We're just deinstalling the dappled light of the sun. The first three clouds we took down last night, so there's one remaining on the ground still. Two have already gone up to Chatsworth House to be installed on the front lawn there. It was an incredible opportunity to have a piece here and make a response to this courtyard and just the scale of it. I mean, I really wanted to try and feel do something quite um, extreme and quite audacious. The whole title suggests it's not, it's sort of the, the effect that it has rather than the object itself. It's sort of, so it's, um, and it's about that universal experience that we all have had of sitting underneath an, uh, an oak tree in the summer and looking at the, the movement of the leaves, the sun through the leaves. So this one was really very much about that as well, but doing it in a very artificial way and only using the tetrahedron. So the one, the one rule of this piece is it only uses the four-sided regular tetrahedron as its shape. And it just, it, it just bifurcates and bifurcates and grows in this sort of radiant way. It's, you can describe them as clouds or as trees or as neural pathways. And it's just, we've used lots of different rules to generate the, the patterns. Mm -hmm.